We had a lot of visitors in our house in Kirk Terrace in those days because the government had taken it over and now it has become SOTA. Uh, so we had a lot of uh, exposure to musicians and one such family was this Raja family where they have a daughter, Selva Lakshmi Tambaya, and uh, Raja used to play the, Mrs. Raja used to play the Jalad Jaladrangam and Mrs. Tambaya was Selva Lakshmi Tambaya was playing the Western violin, but in an Indian orchestra, uh, modern orchestra group. So I think my mother was somehow, uh, uh, they were instrumental in my uh, to my mother for sending me for Western music. She wanted somebody in the family to learn Western music. So I started in the Far East Music School, which was just number one Kirk Terrace in those days. And I finished grade five, uh, uh, Western music, both the theory and the practical. But because my sisters were more in the Carnatic vocal singing, I was also, by listening, I also liked the Carnatic feel. So after that, I went into Carnatic violin at the Singapore Fine Arts Society and also finished uh, uh, seven, eight years of. Uh, a violin training there. I think all this I l kept it on a low profile when I went into the university, uh, finished my education and then I went into the teaching profession. Uh, it was a little bit lying low but I used to play for my sisters accompanying and then there was this orchestra which Mrs. Tambaya introduced me to called the Ramakrishna Sangeeta Sabha Orchestra run by one Dr. Chota Singh, he's no more now. It was an all-ladies orchestra, even the Murdangis is a lady. After Dr. Chota Singh passed away, uh, the orchestra died. You know, uh, I think it was somewhere in the 1970s, you know, uh, uh, when I was maybe about 20 years old, you know. Uh, it took a, a natural death after his time and uh, in uh, 1978 uh, the new management committee of which my elder sister was also uh, of the Ramakrishna uh, Sangeeta Sabha but without the orchestra they were just functioning for religious uh, functions and so forth uh, they decided to revive the orchestra and my name was suggested uh, to be the conductor of the orchestra. It was a voluntary group only, there's no. So I joined the orchestra and I started with about 12 members and uh, we were doing more Carnatic style of performing, whereas Dr. Chosad Singh did more of the Hindustani, I did more of the South Indian Carnatic. So it, 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 it took a different turn in, in that sense, but I also played light uh, pieces, not too heavy pieces. Uh, because it was a North Indian group and uh, we performed in temples and we were doing, we even took part in the first time ever held music competition, started in uh, 79 and we won the first prize in Singapore, in Singapore national music uh, competition and so that spurred the orchestra on till about 1983. Uh, my mother passed away when she was only 16, the year of 1975. So I, my father was with me till his last days and he felt that, uh, uh, he fell ill actually uh, in 1983 and I felt I had to give, and I got married in 81 with my two children born in 82 and 83. It was quite a heavy load. The orchestra rehearsals used to take place in my home which was uh, at Hertford Road and apartment.